Hi guys, it's Stacy. I'm going to be doing another review today on the Speedy 40 Bandolier and also the Original Club uh, Pink Insert. There's the name. And this one has, uh, this is the organizer that has a detachable insert with compartments. So it can be without compartments or you can take this center piece out and it'll just be one big hole just like the Speedy. Therefore, I just kept it in because I'd rather have more organization. And I wanted to show you guys because I did get it today, the organizer. Uh, the bag I've actually had for about a month but I haven't used it because I was waiting for my organizer. This is the bag that it came in. And so I will be showing you this beauty right here. Let me put this to the side. This beauty. The Speedy Bandolier 40. And I replaced the strap. My strap is in great condition, but I would prefer, especially for the summer months, to go ahead and use a mono strap. And I, I bought this pre-loved it's adjustable which is great and I'm pretty sure it's from the pochette Matisse and so just want to show you guys I think I got this for a great price and just in time too because I went to a Louis Vuitton store where was it it was in uh, Stanton the Stanton Mall in California and I spoke with the SA and she said that they are going to be discontinuing this bag. This is what she told me. And I think I had heard it somewhere else as well. Maybe it's because it's like call, uh, call to order or something on the website, but I'm not quite sure. But then once I bought this bag, I saw other people commenting on the group. Oh, I thought I saw Speedy 40B for you know, for sale on the site. And then they commented back that it was sold. So luckily I got on it right when I saw it because I, I don't know, I just needed this bag, but I do have a regular Speedy 40, which I will be putting up for sale because obviously I don't need it. And thank goodness, because once I got this one with the strap, it made such a difference. And so I know that my Speedy, the original, the classic, is newer, but I prefer to have, well, I don't prefer to have the strap, I have to have the strap, because it makes it so much easier for me to carry, and just, this doesn't fit on the crook of my arm, and I'll show you guys that after we're done talking about this bag. Okay, so again, Here's the organizer, and I will be wrapping the handles with Twillies. Uh, there will not be LV Twillies. Hopefully, it'll be a solid color. I did buy some, but they're pretty funky material, not material, uh, pattern. And so I would like to get just a regular pretty gold or something like that. So if you guys know where I can get some, please leave a comment below. Okay, so... The reason why I went with Original Club versus the Samorga, I think it's called, and I can't remember the other one that I purchased from. It's a very popular one as well, but it's more flimsy and it comes like with inserts that you could stick inside of it. Um, because I think that that plastic might hurt the piping in this if I'm not being careful with it, because it looks like the piping or that plastic piece in the other organizer my shift in the bag while I'm using it and I'm not one to always like constantly look and make sure everything is okay inside my bag so this one is very it's pretty thick you guys this this is actually the how thick the material is but the it's so soft and I don't think that's gonna hurt anything in regards to piping or anything in the corners and I'll show you guys how it looks when it's inside the bag. So I guess there's a secret way to put these in. I 
don't know, I just shove it in there and then I'll just worry about it once it's inside. I have an original club also for my artsy and I didn't put it in during my video, but you can still see it. Okay, so it is in and it doesn't have the shape of an organizer to me it doesn't and that's what I love about this is that you can't really tell that I have an organizer in here uh, I haven't obviously packed it with anything yet but I kind of want it to be slouchy because I don't want it to be super full and super circle on a super circle body that's just not something that I think would be nice I want it to kind of be like a silhouette or like a extension of your body if you will because that's what the crossbody is supposed to look like that's what I think anyways I'm pretty critical when it comes to uh, shoes <laughs> and when it comes to handbags on bigger people just because it's my body and that's how I feel so anywho um, Let's see, what else can I tell you about this bag? I haven't used it, like I said, but I do love it. I am so happy that I got this bag with the bandolier because first, I will say that I was gonna take the Speedy and I was going to attach a bag, or I'm sorry, a strap to these. But then I thought, well, why would I do that? I'm gonna damage the bag if I decide to carry a lot of stuff in it that's not I mean, obviously, that's not how it was meant to be carried, so I didn't think maybe I shouldn't go that route. So, I got this bag instead, and I'm so happy that I did. And another thing that I wanted to talk about is, yesterday, I was looking online at videos about uh, replica bags. And I don't know how I came across them, but there's actually a lot of videos on replica Louis Vuittons. And I was like, okay, well, I just wanted to watch it. I was just curious. So I noticed that our, or I can't say our, but um, Louis Vuitton has, I don't think it's symmetrically shaped. Here, let me show you what I'm talking about. Do you see that? Like, look at the piping on this. It's different. It's not equal. And I think that's on purpose. Because when I looked and I watched the videos of the other bags, I saw that they were literally the same on each side. And that's a good way to tell if it's a replica or not. Because I haven't seen one yet a Louis Vuitton that is perfectly symmetrical on each side. It They look like this. So, see this one is like a bit straighter, and then this one comes out a bit more. Oops, I thought that was the bag, but it's actually the strap. So, can you guys tell? I'm a symmetrical person. What is on the left has to be on the right. That's just me. But that's how I noticed that there is a difference. So if anything, that's something that we can look for when we're looking at bags in regards to speedies anyways. So last but not least, I will show you what it looks like on me. It's awesome. I'm going to be using this as a weekender bag because I was thinking about getting one of the carry-alls, but I was like, why would I do that when my 40 is perfectly fine? Getting a 55 key ball is going to be super heavy to try to carry. I'll just have to be handing it off to my husband to carry because I'm not going to carry that big old bag stuffed with shoes and makeup and clothes. And my clothes don't weigh like five ounces. So I figured I can use this as a weekender bag and then still have luggage, right? That's perfect. Okay, so now I'm gonna show you guys what it looks like on. Okay, I'm super excited. That's not bad, right? Strap on the shoulder. You can adjust it if you use this one. 
but I love this. And the organizer is still in here. Nothing is in here, but I love how I could have it kind of, see how in the inner, but not on the outside. The outside still keeps its shape, but the inside is hugging my hip. I really like the way this, this looks. All right, guys. Thank you for watching. Bye.